And a half million people were urged to evacuate, many now taking refuge here in Metro Atlanta. Atlanta News First, Chelsea Vinefor is live at five at a hotel in Stockbridge. It's about 450 miles north of where Milton expected to make landfall tonight. And Chelsea hotels here, they are packed with families from Florida. Yeah, many of those travelers telling us this was the first area off Interstate 75 that they could find an open room. The manager here at the Super 8 confirms they are completely booked for tonight and for the next several days. Now, this is the second time in two weeks that a lot of people have had to evacuate due to severe weather. Florida resident Cheryl Gray says Hurricane Helene destroyed her house in Clearwater, so she moved in with her daughter in Tampa. Yesterday, they were told to get out, and she was not taking any chances chances after that first storm. Gray headed north with her daughter, her dogs and the few belongings that she has left. And we had to evacuate, so we left yesterday and joined the traffic with everybody else and got here. Came to this place because they were one of the dog friendly hotels. Experience one storm, you only turn around and get another. Now we've also seen several linemen stationed at some uh, hotels down here in Henry County today. Several of them telling us they'll spend the night here and then make their way south towards Tampa after Milton rolls through. Reporting live in Stockbridge, Chelsea Vine for Atlanta News First.